Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. I am Dr. Muhammad Mehtab Alam, and I am going to explain type one and type two error in hypothesis testing. So, type one error, we have already discussed that when you are rejecting true null hypothesis, it is called type one error. So, let's start with the type two error. What is type two error? It is committed when a researcher fails to reject a false null hypothesis the probability of committing a type 2 error is referred as beta some refer to power or 1 minus alpha this is alpha the chances of rejecting the null when it is false instead in practice we don't know whether the null is true type 1 and type 2 error rate are inversely related if you reduce one you increase the other one way of reducing both type 1 and type 2 error rate is to increase the sample size but that require more time and more money try to understand type 1 and type 2 error or decision rule from here so with this table state null true so here when null is true and you fail to reject you are you are fail to reject and it is true then it is called type 2 error and if rejecting true null hypothesis then it is called type 1 error alpha so this alpha and beta is important and out of these two beta is more dangerous because you are accepting the wrong things 